celebrities are arriving at Cannes for Wednesday's opening of its 64th film festival. Not everyone's there to win awards, so some are primarily using Cannes 64 to showcase movies for the box office. Among them, DreamWorks. Kat Dealey looks at the creative engine behind one of Hollywood's largest animation studios. Uh -oh. A lovable ogre, a talkative donkey, and a fighting panda. They all began as ideas inside the heads of animators here at DreamWorks, the studio that uses the power of computer technology to unleash the power of dreams. Audiences, kids in particular, do find a stronger connection today uh, with the CG characters. It has a dimensionality to it that actually makes the characters and the worlds themselves richer, and it makes it a more immersive experience. Puss. Turning crazy ideas into movies that work is a long haul journey. <laughs> but it's one that DreamWorks has repeatedly embarked on. In 2001, its movie Shrek won the first ever Academy Award given to an animated feature. <laughs> Next month's Kung Fu Panda 2 will be its 16th computer-generated movie. The tools may have changed from paint and acetate to keypad and mouse, but the heart of any great movie remains the same. The hardest thing in the world is, uh, you know, just telling a really, really good story, and it's why it takes us still four years to make these movies. What's this stage called? It's called Storyboards. We will have a script and then we make the visual script and we add and change and change. It's like having a play that you get to be in rehearsals, you get to do dress rehearsals, something's not working, you go back, you rewrite a scene. That's what our process allows us is to get it right. And the last thing we do is actually animate it. I think the challenge of, of getting the animation really, really blazing is you don't do the obvious. You have to make sure that it's not the stereotypical expression for any given moment, because that would be just bad acting. We also have mirrors that will start just acting, making different faces in front of, to see all the different details. If we want to see exactly what happens when I go from a, a happy to, to a frown, I'll see that my brows come down, so then I'll jump into manipulating the brows. Animation is an intensive process. Two weeks of an animator's work fills only three and a half seconds of screen time. Walt Disney had this great mission statement, and he said, I make movies for children and the child that exists in all of us. 17 years later here at DreamWorks, this is what we do. We make movies for adults and the adult that exists in every child. And I say that with a, a wink and a nod to, to Walt Disney. That's our true north. <laughs>